Imagine details have it that other statesmen and custodians of cultures who are very particular about protecting the reputation of the revered throne of Ife and the current occupier Oni Oni Adeyeye Enitongunsi have moved to take care of the latest story of collapsed marriage erupting from the palace. Details available reveal that the peacemakers trying to salvage the marriage of the Oni of Ife are led by former President Ulusheg Obasanjo. Obasanjo played a major role in Obadeyeye Enitongunsi's ascending the throne in 2015. Baba, Elder, Obasanjo has always been watching out for the Oni. He has a very serious influence on the revered king. He immediately swung into action when the story broke yesterday. He has been hard at work to ensure the royal marriage is savaged. Society now does NG gathered. More details have it that Obasanjo, who is arguably the most respected African leader abroad, is joined in the peacemaking effort to restore the marriage of Oni of Ife to estranged Queen Sile Kwonla by the likes of Otumba Iola Omishuri, Irelu Abiola Dusumu, and very regarded Sir Alice Duduyemi and other major players here and there, society now does NG learned. Society does NG gather that Sir Alex Duduyemi is playing a major role because he was with Oni at an engagement in Lagos when the post by the Queen announcing the end of the marriage that has pronounced or produced a son, Prince Tadenikawu, hit town. Queen Sile Kola left the palace three weeks before she announced the marriage breakup. Society now does NG gathered. The queen left the over refusal to abide by the king's decision that it was time for her, for her mother and six siblings who moved into the palace with her three years, with her three years ago to take up residence outside her marriage. She insisted she goes everywhere her mother does and left with her mother when the only refused to back down on his decision society now does ng stated added digs up that the current claim about hacking of the queen's social media pages by the palace of the only is the product of the intense efforts by chief obasanjo and others to salvage the royal marriage hmm. the story is just building up many things will come up Many things we come up, just like I said, that uh, this uh, statement or this post that the woman made, <laughs> not it was not just yesterday that the marriage ended, because before now there is uh, there has been back and forth concerning this their marriage, a lot of issues here and there, gossips here and there, and what have you, and again, the spokesperson of the king that was trying to do damage control saying that uh, oh two of them slept together in the same room so how come and all of that now we are hearing again that she had left three weeks ago and this issue of her uh, oh is her mother must stay inside the house and all of that all those don't say those are rumors and a lot of rumors and a lot of lies left right and center people will even be making up some things that is not even emanating from the couple so it is expected but I think at some point it will die down. But for her to have stated this on social media shows that she's just ready and she's not even ready to go back into that palace. So we are going to be hearing more, 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 more details. Even she herself, she has even responded today. That it's not because of all of those things. That she has already made up her mind and she believes that freedom is more paramount to her. But I don't know whether this, uh, the... Yoruba elders and the so-called Obasanjo and the other elders, whether they will be able to intervene in this matter, I, I strongly doubt. OBJ is the wrong man for such a job. He failed in many of his several marriages. You can't give what you don't have. What is the color of your problem? As you failed in your ways to name the part he failed, if it is true that the lady insisted that her sibling and mom should stay in the palace with her, then she's not serious. She's trying to paint the man black and whip unnecessary sentiments 
how can she be dictating for her husband mm. how can you even be on we how do you expect how do you even believe her this kind of a story you just say something how do you know she never said anything but she just said the way the man portrays himself is not the way he is at home so she didn't say more than that so all these stories here and there so this is what some people will not be haha <laughs> it is it might not be true it is very shameful for Naomi's mom and siblings to live in the palace. Can you imagine? Some people are beginning to run with that. How do you know? If it is true that her mom and siblings are living with them for the past three years, I beg Queen Mother, this Omogo don't do. She no get shame. Now husband has with the wife's home. Can you imagine? I don't understand the story of the mother queen abandoning her own home to take up residency with the queen of the palace who takes care of her own husband back home. Which culture permits this in your land? The queen's mother no even gets shame. <laughs> hey, this is the only thing that people will not be talking about. Who. You make matter worse. Were, uh, were you there when that decision was made? Are you sure what you read was the truth? Exactly. She might not be the truth. Money and fame sometimes are never enough to save marriage. What could be the problem here? And what was the woman lacking? They shouldn't beg her if she feels it is the best course of action so as to be happy in life. Let her go. If you settle today, tomorrow, Uncle, what happens? Some are intolerant, intolerant and can never be satisfied. Good morning, everyone. To be honest with you, what is how that is how our current ladies behave. Who? If they marry to any state, they will ask their family to come and stay in her husband's house. Or I never enjoy a girl. They have tied his neck on the mango tree. Oba with many side chicks, <laughs> the small girl need a stabilizing force around her. One of the problems affecting King Adia's marriage is, is his liberal approach to kingship. Kings are not better husbands than most normal husbands. Most of them are even worse, giving their huge appetites for women. Yet you will hardly hear of any third party intervening in marital conflicts of Yoruba kings. The very approach of the queen taking to the social media to announce the collapse of the marriage without any repercussion speaks to the liberty of the king. Hmm. Let the mom and siblings of the uh, queen vacate the king's house. Nah. They may cost too much, Yawa. Please, Queen, allow the king to make this desired decision regarding the family. If it is true that Naomi's mom and siblings are staying, are staying with her in the palace, a good mother would not let her daughter marriage fade because of that. She can be given an apartment outside the palace. Why must she stay with her daughter? Tomorrow again, we are going to hear different things. So guys, the most important thing, or the main thing that me I want to take from this whole thing, that Obasanjo you're trying to intervene. But if she has made up her, her mind, I don't think there's any any force that would bring her back. A lot of stories, a lot of things will come up. Oh, this one did, this one did, this one did. But for her to go on social media to announce that, oh God, that is the height of it. She had already made up her mind. So guys, let's hear your opinion on this.